what would be the number one tip that you would give a woman who wants to take pictures of their kids? You know, I think uh, I read an interesting article last year about um, photography today. Now, um, you know, I, I think that the most important thing that you can do when you take photographs of your children is give it some thought. And um, it, it's an interesting concept today because everyone just takes photographs everywhere, you know? And, and you go into museums and do people actually look at these paintings? I know they're just running around taking photographs of them, you know? Um, and, and photography has become so ubiquitous. And I think that if you put some thought into an image, in, into what you're doing, um, it, it's so much more worthwhile. These days, people, they, they're constantly photographing and photographs just become a thought pattern. And I think that's quite a dangerous thing. Um, and, and so, you know, if I just can give you advice, um, keep your background simple. Don't try to do what I do because I'm in a photographic studio with a team of professionals. <laughs> I'm going to show you some Don't hang your baby from the high of a chair. No, <laughs> don't do that. Like, don't oh, do that. No. No, I think you... you I'm kidding, I really wasn't yeah. kidding. Yeah. <laughs> um, you've got to get down to their level um, because that's why children see the world. And try to um, keep things simple. Watch what's happening in your background. Always be careful of that. You don't want chairs growing out of heads and all that sort of thing, you know. Um, um, it, and it, simplicity is key, right? And when I first started doing portraiture many years ago, my and, and I did portraiture for 10 years, um, my main aim was to say photographing a two-year-old in a studio, I would think about the family looking at that photograph of a two-year-old 20 years on, right? When you've, you've got an adult um, and you want to remember what they were like when they were little and on that day when they didn't want to wear matching socks or they didn't want to do this, let them do whatever they do. So you've got to capture aspects of their personality. I think that's really, really important. And I know a lot of people don't like to do this, but include yourself in the photograph because your children will love to mock you for this later. <laughs> and I had a lot of photographs of my girls in the 80s, so you can imagine what they mocked me for. <laughs> but they wanted that your children never think of you. you if, if you've got little ones, they will never remember you at the age that you are now. So they'll want to see what you looked like when they were that age. I think yeah. it's really, really important because most children think their parents were never young. Yeah. <laughs> That's true.